Today we're going to be talking about Eiler, Danlos syndrome, EDS. So the Eiler's Danlos syndrome is a inherited collagen disorder and there are different collagen mutations that produce the various types and as an ophthalmologist you should be aware of some of the different Eiler Danlos types because the types make a difference. So the first is Gravis, which is the classic form. And then there's a, a mini-me version of this, which is the Mitis form. And then we have the type three form, which is the one that's the most obvious, which is the hypermobility form. And in the hypermobility form, they have hypermobility of their joints and there are a number of scoring regimens that have been re used in the, and you can go Google all these, so where the patients can bend their fingers or touch around their thumbs and various different ways of bending their joints. They're basically human versions of Elastigirl. Number four is the one we really are afraid of, which is the vascular form. And that vascular form is what produces arterial dissections, aneurysms, and non-traumatic carotid cavernous fistulas because the wall is weak. The wall in the artery is weak and it can come to us as a Horner syndrome or a pupil involved third nerve palsy or carotid cavernous fistula. And then we have the X-linked form, which is like a Midas, except its inheritance pattern is the X-linked form. Then we have this ocular form, which is also associated with scoliosis, which is Irish Danlo 6. This ocular one has thinness of the ocular structures because the collagen is bad. So you could have thin sclera, which shows up as blue sclera. You could have thin cornea, which is keratoconus. You could have thin retina, which is myopic degeneration and retinal detachments and angioid streaks, which look like vessels, but they're deeper. They're not really vessels. They're breaks in the Brooks membrane. And you could have thin muscles causing strabismus. And then the two that don't come to us are uh, the arthrochalasis form, the joint form, congenital dislocations, and the periodontal form. So both of these, the joint form and the eye, uh, the tooth form, don't really come to us. So the ones that we see are the ocular forms, thin eye, and the vascular forms, which are the, the dangerous ones. And so you need to know a little bit about Eiler Danlos, collagen disorder, inherited, different mutations. Think about it in patients who have thin blue sclera, keratoconus, myopic degeneration, angioid streaks, strabismus, and beware of the vascular form of EDS.